Hey guys, my name is Scobie and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to add multiple featured channel lists to your YouTube account. This is going to allow you to customize them, separate them however you want. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do everything. Let's jump right into this. So the first thing you need to do is of course open up YouTube and you're going to have to be logged into your account. Once your YouTube is open and you're logged in, we're going to be clicking on our user profile here on the top right. And we're going to be clicking on the YouTube studio option right here. Once your YouTube studio opens up, the first thing you'll be brought to is your YouTube dashboard. What we're going to be doing is coming over to the left panel right here. And we're going to be coming to the second last option here called customization. Once we select this open, we will get some customization options for our channel. We're actually going to be sticking on the layout tab right here. And if we scroll down here, we will see the featured sections option. And here we can see a list of all currently created and set up featured sections. Now at the moment, I currently have one channel feature selection. If we look at the bottom right here, I have the banter brigade and I have currently three users set up to be shown here. However, to add other sections, we can easily do this by clicking on add section. What we can do is come down to the bottom underneath channels and we can click on featured channels. And here we'll have some options to set up another feature channel section on our YouTube. So what we can do is give this a title. For example, let's say it's example. And what we can do is search for any channel on YouTube. Let's just say, for example, I search SCOBY Tech, my own channel. What I can do is select my old channel right here and my channel will now be added to this section. So what I'm actually going to be setting up is another section that shows off all the other channels I currently have. So what I'm going to be doing is naming this channel section, my other channels. In this case, I've already added myself, even though this is my current channel. So to remove a channel, we can really easily come to channels in this section on the right, hover over the channel you don't want to have here anymore, click remove from group, and then you can easily remove a channel. Once you've added all the channels and you're happy with the layout, what we can do is click down on the bottom right. And now these channels will be added here. If you'd like to change or rearrange the order, you can come here to the left. Your cursor will change to a little hand symbol, and then you can just drag and drop between these layers and move them around. If you'd like to change any options or remove any sections, what you can do is come to the right, click on the three dots menu, and here we can edit section content, or we can remove the section. So you can really easily edit this whenever you would like and come back here whenever you're happy. Now, one thing you should keep in mind when doing this is you can currently customize up to 10 sections. So you can have a maximum of 10 sections. This will include video play playlists, uploads, and featured channels. So this is something to keep in mind when you're adding things here. You can have up to 10 in total. Once all of your settings are done and you're ready to save, what we need to do is come up to the top right of this page and we're going to be clicking publish. From this point, if you'd like to view the channel and view your changes, what we can do is click the view channel button right here. Now, once we view our channel, it is important to keep in mind this can take a couple seconds to a couple minutes to fully upload on your channel. So you may have to be a little bit patient here while everything updates. Feel free to come in and check in a little bit later. And if we scroll down on our homepage, we should be able to see my other channels right here and we should be able to see the banter brigade channels here as well what we can also do is come back to the top of our home page we can click on the channels tab right here and here you can see it currently still needs to be loaded i can actually see the banter brigade twice but i can also see my other channels right here and you can see both my other channels show up here without any issues now a cool thing about the channels tab is it now actually has filters and sections so what you can do is select all channels but you can also filter by feature channels subscriptions my other channels and banter brigade so for example if i select my other channels right here you can see it shows up without any issue and it's as easy as that to add multiple feature channel sections on youtube now again as mentioned it is worth waiting a couple minutes maybe even 10 15 before checking this as it can take a little bit of time to update fully on your channel but once it's there it works really well and this is a really nice addition that we can add multiple feature channels on our account so it really adds some customization options so you can really share and promote either your friends or your other channels or whatever feels best for you at the time anyway guys it's as easy as that to create multiple feature channels on your youtube account if you guys enjoyed this tutorial be sure to drop a like subscribe if you're new check out the other videos on the channel i'm going to be leaving a link down below to my paypal find these videos helpful and you want to support me anyway guys thank you so much for watching until next time as always keep it saucy peace